Hopefully by now you have seen the square root symbol that I have behind me. And what I want to talk about right now is just some common mistakes that people use when they, sorry, people do when they use the square root. Okay. So what I want to talk about is the difference between the square root of 25 and the difference of x squared is equal to 25. Okay. The square root is what we call the principal root. Okay. And what that means is the main thing that comes out of it. And typically that is going to be positive when you're dealing with the square root. So the square root of 25 is just 5. Okay? A lot of students like to put plus or minus in front of it. It's not the case. It's just the positive 5. Okay. The difference is dealing with x squared is equal to 25. In order to solve this, we want to take a square root. So what we do is we put a square root in. Okay? And then in this case, whenever you take the square root, you need to end up with plus or minus. Okay? So the difference is is that whenever there is a square root in the problem, it's the principal root. If it's you're dealing with a square root, it's just going to be positive. When you are solving something and you put in the square root, you then need to include plus or minus. Okay? So when you're including a square root as a tool, so you put it in as a tool to solve something, you need to think about plus or minus. When the square root is already there, it's just positive.